you ever feel lost? Well, I do. I sometimes feel trapped in life itself and I find myself asking, who am I? What makes me, me? Silly question, right? You're you and I'm me. My mind plus my body equals me. And although they can feel quite disconnected at times, mostly we are comfortable in our sense of self. In our own bodies, walking around, it's all we know. Now, I don't know what it's like to be you, but I know what it's like to be me. And this feeling, this sense of self, has a sort of qualia, a quality that's very easy to grasp in our own heads, but becomes incredibly difficult when we try and put it into words. What's it like to be you? Who are you? That's not an easy question. We can't just pull out one perfect word that describes the essence of you. We're all a lot more complicated than that. But then I start panicking. Wait, so then what if I know this person my whole life but I don't really know them because I don't know who they are or who they think they are, who I think they are. But when a clouded mind clears, the camera zooms and I can see that I don't need to figure you out like a puzzle because you're not. You don't have an answer, you're a person. We're complicated little buggers. So now I'm thinking, if it's not the answer, maybe it's the question. A search for self. Well, we don't need to dig deep inside ourselves for the one perfect answer because we're constantly growing, developing and forming new bonds all the time while saying you. And I think that's pretty cool. So you can't be in someone's head, but you can communicate with them, be honest with them and create a unique relationship that you share. I dare say you even know this person. My point is that you don't have to be in someone's head to truly know them. You shape them and they shape you. Our experiences are part of what make us us. And I would say if someone is part of you, then they know you pretty well. The best we can do is keep in touch with ourselves and keep in touch with others. Communicate openly and, honest, and with honesty, however you best phrase it or show it. So don't worry about finding an answer to you. To find you, be you. Thank you.